did you have days where you woke up and it, it was you, you had deep dark thoughts i mean you know if you could kind of highlight the, that part of it that'd be great because you know so many people they get turned away from doctors and they say you know you have to go see a psychiatrist and you know obviously you could go see a psychiatrist you can get on these these programs but if you're still living inside the problem i don't i don't think it's really going to solve much other than suppressing symptoms like we touched on earlier you know can you can you highlight some of the anxiety issues that you dealt with and um you know kind of how you were able to recognize that it was not natural yeah i do remember thinking a lot of like what is wrong with me like what is going on and like you know in a sense of like i don't know how to fix it i don't know how to as a health coach myself you know let's eat healthy let's exercise and it was way beyond that it was way beyond like just the normal kind of like healthy things that we do it was it was more serious in a in the sense of like i don't know what this is i don't know how to fix it therefore how do you have hope how do you have hope if you don't know how to if you don't even know what it is and so those thoughts were were pretty scary in a sense of like is this just what normal aging is <laughs> yeah. even though i knew it wasn't um it was scary and it is a sense of like i don't know has anybody experienced this before because nobody that i had ever heard of had really talked about it and you know really once i started diving into like the symptoms it was just like okay these thoughts of like there isn't hope or what is wrong with me are pretty normal because you, it is just so unnormal <laughs> right yeah it's normal to have those things when you're experiencing this but obviously you saw a shift like you didn't normally have those thoughts before you were in mold right right so you, you saw this shift and as it comes over you you're trying to figure it out and i think that's where a lot of the hopelessness comes from because you're you're you know we're all we're all sentient beings right we're trying to figure out what's going on something's different we're noticing that but we don't have answers and so that mystery kind of really causes some confusion and and really puts us in a dark place and I, you know I, i totally understand um you know what what that what that can entail and uh i appreciate you kind of sharing that with us because i know it's uh you know it's 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 tra traumatizing to kind of go through those experiences